Hey guys, welcome back to a new video. Today's video, let's talk about Rosies. But before we do that, like, subscribe, turn on notifications, go to the description, follow all our social medias, join our Discord server, Roblox group, join it. We sell Roblox outfit. You can purchase them there as well. If you want, you can be a YouTube member. Shout out to Kenny and Q Beck for being our YouTube members. It helps the channel, supports it. 99 cents to up to $4.99. Gives you perks around the channel. You could check it out for yourself if you're interested behind the scenes and everything else now this is going to be a little bit more of a little quick serious talk about what could actually lead to the downfall of rel c's now some of you are probably already typing down there in the comments oh rel c's is never going to fall off it's never going to flop or anything okay yeah, that's your opinion but okay man whatever point being is this video just to talk to you guys about a few things and a lot of content creators and other people agree to it but some of them just don't want to talk about it since, you know, the community is so like, no, it is a good game and this and that. And then say, oh, you're hate speech or this and that. No, that's not hate speech. Criticism. A lot of these little kids don't know what criticism is or these adults at childish don't know what criticism is. Now, this movie, this whole movie, right? It's AI trash why use your voice they all type this down okay ignore the ai part what is the what is there else to complain about what is there to criticize them quote unquote well the fact that they're pasting let's move that a bit of a side too the amount of cursing there is oh cursing what have you never heard curse words well, okay go up all right let's move that aside too glazing it's just over hyping the game honestly there brown sees you guys some people over hype this game and they just give out like he's a glazer we know this revolver laser who else is a glazer i don't know if he deleted his comment probably not they ain't ready for this who ain't ready for this bro He's, he's a blocks for YouTuber. Anyways, I can't find him, but Sage. Glazers, bro. Because Rel C's made, the Rel Brothers made Shinobi Life 2 once. And that did really good. Now, not saying that Shinobi, uh, Rel C's is not going to be good. Also, this gets very confusing. Rel, Rel, or everything. Okay, whatever. Rel C's. I'm not saying it's going to go be a flop. It's really hard. I'm just saying. People have these expectations for this game so high and people are glazing over the games. I'm just saying, like, just some people really need to limit their their hype or their expectations. Especially these YouTubers that overhype this game and calling out other games brain rot or brain dead or whatever else they could combine with or think of to insult another game they, they don't like because they are not able to play it's roblox bro play something else there is other games you could play you hate a game there okay don't play it stop complaining about it move on all these blocks for people they can't complain about it don't complain about blocks roots the grinding and stuff like that it is insane i totally agree being like, leveling up to 2500 you must be crazy i am crazy i was crazy once they locked me up in a rubber room a rubber room with rats and here i am no, I'm just kidding, but for real. Overhyping this game and then hating on other games. The Real Brothers have to call on about it and <laughs> this doesn't really matter because either way, they still did it. Their own video, they're saying, oh, Neon Brick, You're just walking around. And it's like, okay, dude. Let's be honest. These YouTubers, they get a lot of clicks and a lot of views on their videos. Talking crap about block streets or stuff like that. They're going to get a lot of views because they love hating on it because they try uh, they like love the interaction and it helps the algorithm Rousey's and block Street are two different games i hope both games could co six and do very well now other thing let's talk about their ego Rob brothers have a really big ego like oh my god bro go a video without trying to like talk about oh we're the best developers or something like that 
a few minutes in the video and you they were already talking about we're the best developers or pro bros or have been working on this the best game and it's like best game to who and then there's people complaining or saying the in comments Rousey's is gonna be the best game on Roblox is going to be or they or sometimes even say it is the best game on Roblox bro how can you know it's the best game if you haven't even played it yet that's like saying Blockchute is the best if you don't think Blockchute is the best and you haven't played it what are you doing bro the Rogue Bros think they they have a very inflated ego they were called out before towards that and they said oh we grown up we we grown up and we won't do it again proceeds to do it in every single video oh bro it's just a joke they just don't mean it how is it a joke if it's every single video it comes to a point where it's not a joke anymore a few other content creators agree on that like just is it necessary all the hate man if you want to play rlc's play it if you want to play block street play it why are you gonna go and hate another game and call them childish it is the most wild thing the bro brothers the rose c's community or just the bro brothers community it is wild it, the ones at least are toxic because there's some of you some of them are it's, maybe you're watching this so you're not you're part of those people there the small few they're like not toxic and say well oh, rose is his own game blocks is his own game i don't like blocks roots but i'm not gonna play it but i if other people play it it's okay because the aid don't do anything bad and i'm gonna be over here doing my own thing those are the peaceful people but the toxic people are the ones that go in the comments saying oh your hate speech or just this and that bro it's real C's. some people really need to show they this also i found a funny comment this one this video has one piece pacing to because the the bosses took so long to showcase and all that i'm gonna make a whole video on this much better to uh members will see like the whole entire me reacting to this every single part but for you guys that are not i'm gonna have it so you guys have it that it's edited so it's just me talking over it so it's much easier for you guys to watch the content edited but anyways Ralsies. The one thing that can make it flop is, well, besides their ego, is their community. If their community continues over hyping the game and having these high uh, high expectations, and if they're not met, that could make the game flop. That's kind of what happened. Not kind of. That is what happened to Tales of Tenario. Lucky HD overhyped the game. Let's be honest. If you if you were listening or watched that whole entire event happen. Lucky HD was overhyping the game, and then other people were overhyping it, and then once it didn't meet people's expectations, the game dip. Now that game has like barely to sustain a thousand players. It's like 200 or 100, and now they change it to beta. Just all I'm saying, if you want to play RLCs, try to limit like your expectations, because there might be things that doesn't get added and it just seems like over hyping a game saying it's gonna be the best game and you have or people haven't even tried it out just because they're real brothers and they get fame or like lots of watch hours or views from just making videos just blazing on the real brothers bro look watch your own videos watch the movies watch people criticizing the game Make up your own opinion on it. And if you like the game, like it. If you hate some parts or don't dislike some parts, then you dislike it. Hopefully the Real Brothers, their ego gets fixed or whatever. I hope the, uh, the Real Seas comes out. Seems like a good game. I want to try the submarine. I keep saying that, but it's true. I want to try the submarine. It is going to be funny. And it will be very interesting. There will be so many clips we could get from that. And hopefully the game comes out. This is also this video. It says December. Never specified which day. So it's not technically a date. It's just the date of the month. And the year. I guess we're going to get in 2024. December. But which day of December? My guess. Christmas. Maybe before Christmas Eve. Would make sense, wouldn't it? 
anyways that's all i have for you for today for the game or talking about the rail brothers if you like this video and want to see my other videos you could click on any of those things you could see on the screen the end screen I like this video subscribe turn on notifications comment down below do you think you'll be able to play rail C's? or do you think rail is gonna be a flop or do you think the rail C's community could you know be a little nicer instead of you know blazing especially some of these youtubers that are wild anyways that's pretty much the video i don't know if i want to talk about this again but seriously some of you people that are glazing on this game need to chill out this is this is insane levels like really some of these youtubers as well so um most of these got called out as well anyways that's pretty much the video so i'll see you guys next time stay safe and take care